Dr. Crowther. Didn't you hear me earlier? <laughs> Doctor. Hi. Is everything all right? Doctor, please, look at me. I report that I've located Dr. Crowther. He's in bad shape. I'm going to examine him now. Hello, anyone there? I repeat, Crowther is in a serious condition. O2 saturation is fine. There's nothing physically wrong with the doctor. His pupils respond properly. Look at my finger. No delay in reactions. Finally. I've been listening to you for two hours now. My receiver is dead. No need to explain yourself, Doctor. I know everything. The transmitter was still working, so I heard your reports. You didn't have it easy. Wait, please. I need to reconnect. Testing. One, two, three. Uh, copy you, Doctor. Loud and clear. Do I understand correctly that the doctor's life is not in imminent danger? That's my initial diagnosis, yes. Yet no response to verbal communication? None. Conclusions, doctor? Do you have any idea what's wrong with him? Both mental illness and serious bodily injury could contribute to this condition. However, he wasn't suffering from any disorders. There's nothing wrong with him physically. Epileptic seizure and chronic diseases can also be ruled out. So what? He's just fine? On the contrary. Something is very wrong with him, and I can't figure out what. Which is even more worrying. I'll prepare the infirmary. But first things first, the lambda. We need to get you all on board. Everyone, not just Dr. Crowther. Couldn't we just evacuate him right away? If it were that easy, I would have sent the hopper long ago. Please look for the mission long, which should include crucial data about the crew's activities. We have three more people to find. And you still need to designate a place for the landing. Dr. Crowther. 